Hello everyone, welcome back to another bite-sized bit. It's Poofy, and today we're playing Licorice Last Words, which is, and I can uh, take a little look about that, uh, it's a visual novel. Let me see, what is the um, description? Deliver three recently departed souls to the afterlife, keep their thoughts com comforted as best as you can, at least. All right. So uh, there's some content content warnings. This game is about death, will contain themes surrounding it, including references and words related to grief, murder, suicide, pandemics, etc. By playing this game, you are agreeing to seeing them. Well, by watching this video, you are agreeing to seeing those. So let's just click start and um, see what the game is about. May 1st, it's my birthday. 3 or 2 p.m. local time. Hmm. What is... Where, where am I? I can't remember. Look at his last words. Abel. That looks pretty neat. Good afternoon to you, sir. Oh. Good afternoon to you, doctor. I, I can't see with this thing on, but this ambulance feels... <laughs> it feels like a carriage. I, I knew my insurance wasn't very good. Because the policy didn't state what kind of wheels it covered, huh? Uh, this is a premium service, sir. <laughs> I'm sure you mean well, but it makes me more anxious. I apologize. I only mean for you to relax and enjoy the ride. Okay. How are you doing back there? Hmm? Oh. I'm thinking about how I really can't wait for my vacation time. Oh, this ambulance ride is really going to set me back. <laughs> the ketchup at work is going to be a mess. Um, oof. This ride is completely free, actually, or good news. A generous donor will be covering you. Uh, that one. Oh no, it's a good thing. I, I'm going to have to write thank you letters, explain myself at work, be on the news. Nothing will happen, it's completely anonymous, my friend. But I was still saved at the end. Well, let's focus on good news, something happy. Happy? Happy. Yes, that. W what makes you happy? I... <laughs> I'm sorry, I, I think I'll take your advice to relax. Sorry to disturb you. As you wish. Oh, what is this about? Pursuit, silence, advertise, consulate, consultation, career. What? What do you want me to click on? Beauty. Rest. Calm, relief, sand, vacation, breather, sunlight, air, sky. This is that relaxing? Driver, oh, I'm feeling a bit better now. This isn't an ambulance, is it? Uh, never said it was. Well, if you're kidnapping me, my life insurance policy can't legally go to you. So I'm just as useless to you as anyone else, I'm afraid. <laughs> no, sir, I'm just your carriage driver. A very good one. Sorry. It seems I don't have my phone to leave you a nice review. No need, but appreciate it. Despite how nice this is, I'm not sure I have the time for this. It's my turn to pick the kids up from school. Again. 
Um, you have all the time in the world that's taken care of. Is it a hassle for you when to talk about it? Ooh. I can't deny that it's a hassle. Traffic, late nights at the office, aftercare, school clubs, making dinner. It adds up. Yes, precisely. <laughs> but people would kill for those kinds of problems. Only some. Yes, not everyone is built for what I have. Would you like to enjoy the quiet for a little while? Thank you. All right, so we got sandals. Uh, ancestry? No. Arrangement? No. What? What do you want me to plan? Him? Mother? I have no idea. Beard? Private? Father? What? Driver, although I'm feeling a bit better, this is an ambulance. Yeah, uh, not exactly. You're, you know what? I'm gonna choose something different. You're not injured. My head's so foggy, I really thought I was. But you're feeling better, right? Haha, <laughs> in certain ways. Then that's all that matters. Despite how nice this is, I'm not sure if it's time for this. Yeah, pick up the kids again. It's taken care of. I wish I could believe you. Daycare, aftercare, school clubs. Yes, that'd be really nice. Sorry, I can't prove it, but your wife is taking care of it. Oh, is she? Sounds happier about it. I am. <laughs> Would you like to enjoy the quiet? Thank you. Yeah, what, what do we do here then? Cologne. Aftershave. Pedigree is not good. Air is not good. Liberty? Brood? No, him? Burly? Relief? Father? Father wasn't good. Shave? What is this about? Necktie? I have no idea what I'm... What, what kind of... What, what, what do we... What do you want me to do here? Cologne. Aftershave. Barstool. Gallantry. Burley. Brewery. No idea. I honestly have no idea. Necktie. Necktie is not good. Shave was good. Bourbon. Are it all manly things or something? What What is going on here? Grizzled? I have no idea. Really, I, I, I don't have a clue. Excuse me. Yes, how can I help you? I'm, I'm not... I'm not going back, am I? No, you're not. Uh, a lot to take in. <laughs> I'm curious about you, you know. What do you do for fun? This is a carriage ride, but it seems a bit dreary. I think I'm pretty normal, a bit of everything. Ah, uh, yes, I bet you've met all sorts of people in a job like this, exposed to all sorts of things. Hey, am I going to hell? Uh, why do you ask? Because I'm... How do I put this? I feel relieved. Relieved I have, I don't have to be around my wife or kids, that I don't have to go home. God, I'm a terrible person. I don't think you're terrible. I've met many people who were pushed into marriages and parenthood. I feel like I've been pushed into just about everything my whole life. You have regrets? I do. So many, actually. Mainly people I've hurt. Guys I've hurt. Real, real good friends. I have a feeling they forgive you. Knowing them? Yeah, they understand. They probably pity me. There was one friend of mine, he was my best friend. I didn't even know him that long, but... 
Abel got me in a way not even my wife did. And he knew it. I knew it. But I should have told him, right? Should have told him how important he was to me instead of all the jokes. Uh, some actions are stronger than words. Yes, that is true. Then, then maybe it's okay. Sounds like you're feeling better. I am. I think I'll enjoy the rest of the ride, in fact. <laughs> What, what is... I really do not understand anything about this. What do you want me to do here? Children, it's not good. Savings, it's not good. Barstool, family, it's not good. Butch. Burly. Manhood. Son? Nope. Pedigree is not good. I have no idea, really. What am I doing there? Uh, normal. I'm gonna choose the same things. What do you ask? Uh, feeling forgive you. I have no idea what this is about. Spice. Therapy? Uh, trail? Wood smoke? Museum? Oh, these are still relaxing things, right? Lodge? Barstool can be relaxing. Profit is not relaxing, okay. Burly. Manhood, succession? No, succession is not relaxing. Potpourri is relaxing. Sorry to bother you again. Never a bother, go on. I, I'm dead, aren't I? Um, I'm sorry. Oh. Oh! No. It's more than alright, it's good, really. Good. I'm just glad it's almost over. You know, the point of being dead is to just stop thinking. <laughs> so, how much longer until I get there, you think? Won't be long now. Not quite there, huh? So, um, like any sports? I've been getting into them. Can't say I'm interested. That's a shame. I found myself interested in learning about other cultures and exercising because of them. I guess I don't need to worry about my health anymore. I'm sorry, I'm trying to make small talk, but... A bit difficult. Can't even ask about the weather right now. Does it always feel like this? It's pretty consistent. People find this the most calming. Mm, I can see that. Mist, fog, rain. If you want to be quiet. I like bright, nice weather though. What else? I don't mind small talk. That's about it. Nice weather, sports, talking with my best friend. I've lived a fairly boring life. <laughs> ah, um, no need to comment. I, I see what you're doing and I'm okay with it. I'm just about ready to move on. I'm happy to hear that, sir. We're almost there. Thanks. Cologne. Uh, festival. Sunny. Aftershave, Lodge, Music, Sanctity, no? Okay, Football, Billiards, Shave, and Private. Oh, we need more, jeez. Basketball? You like sports, right? So, a stroll, it's also relaxing. No, we're there. We're here. Aw, oh, goodbye. Thank you. Um, have a nice day. Goodbye. Goodbye. That's pretty sad. Soothing, though. Don't get me wrong, this was very soothing. 
May 1st, 7.27 p.m. local time. Still my birthday. Oh, oh, my head. Ah, where am I? All right, it's okay. You're safe now. Good evening, you're pretty. Sorry, my head is... I feel so... foggy. And it's just like this air. The pollution in this area must be atrocious. Uh, it's not... No, oh, please, if it's not one thing, it's another. Either way, it's not good for your airways. Uh, understood. Ah, <laughs> good. I'm glad you're an attentive driver. You're... You started smiling. Oh, uh, thanks. Take into account the other people who get into your carriage. If this is a frequent route, you should consider carrying face masks. What if you have a senior, an asthma patient, a child? You have to consider the little ones with smaller airways, always, regardless of the route length. Uh, fair point. <laughs> ha! You don't have to sound so nervous, I don't bite. Besides, you sound kind to me. Oh, I appreciate that. Of course. Forgive me if I'm stern sometimes, I'm just looking out for you and any little ones. Healthcare is full of miracles that many have died for. And life is precious, we should always use them when we're able. Uh, sounds like you are fond of children. That obvious, huh? I love them. Even when I was a little girl, I babysat a lot. Time is an enemy of life. I always thought people should cherish their youth. You sound very kind to me as well. Ha! <laughs> I... Oh. Ma'am? My apologies. I just feel so faint is all. The fogginess never left. I... I guess time is my enemy again. Please, just give me a moment. Of course, I'll be quiet, I'll let you relax. Thank you. So you want children things, right? Health, health and children, girlhood, baby, youth, child, absolutely, you like those things. Uh, physician, anatomy, nutrition, all right, this is all going good. And uh, elementary, whatever. Okay, okay, I got a little bit of energy boost, haha. <laughs> Nice to see you perked up. You can't be in my position without bouncing back quickly. You're a doctor? Yes, I'm a pediatrician. I've been practicing for... No, I don't want to say that now. I feel old. Nothing wrong with aging. You're so right. Age looks good on me. Fine wine, they say. I wonder what things would have been like if I'd stayed with the veterinary track. I used to think I'd have claw marks instead, but it turns out kids love to bite too. <laughs> Sounds like you have stories. Oh, honey. Infinite. Kids are animals I have the strangest experiences with. I had a patient who was just as obsessed with cats as I was with kids. That kid would scratch up the nurses with sharpened popsicle sticks like she was Wolverine. <laughs> you sound like you really enjoy your job. Yes. I wanted to show you a photo I have in my watch, but I don't have it. I don't have anything. I should be freaking out, I think, but... Uh, what was the photo of? It was a charity day at the hospital. I took a photo of all the kids and the service animals. But I'm not sure those days are coming back anytime soon. No? Money is so tight at the hospital, and ever since the pandemic? Well, we are understaffed at best. I lost good friends and good people. Sorry, I didn't mean to down the mood. I apologize, how about relaxing for a while? It's healthy to relax, I know, it's just difficult. I understand. Just think about all these things that make you happy. Yes, thank you, I'll do that. Preschool, hedgehog, uh, child, health, 
Scrubs Pharmacy Feline. Uh, uh, dang it. Baby. Youth. A zoo, you like that. Uh, antidote, obviously. And a uh, little piglet. Driver. Yes, feeling better. You don't have to pretend anymore. Even with this foggy head. I understand that I'm dead. Uh, I didn't mean to deceive you. I know, you, you've been kind to me. But this matches up with things I've heard from my most ill patients. Somewhere dark, rolling along a road in a carriage, dressed in clothes most can't afford. But more than all of that, I... Oh yes, I was wearing my scrubs. A patient's cat was stuck in a tree, starving. No one would do it, so I went up there and... I fell. I fell and I knew I... I, I couldn't scream. I was terrified. I couldn't... I fell for so long that I thought I might be dreaming. I'm sorry you remember so much. Most people don't. I guess I'm more attuned to death than most. Even among other doctors or morticians, it's rare. You must be unlucky. God, I, I... I understand, you know, that everyone dies. At any time, at any age. But... But... But I had so much left to do. I wanted to grow old. I wanted to fall in love. There are so many children waiting on me and... Now I'll be yet another adult who has disappeared on them. Um, are those truly your regrets? Isn't that what everyone wants? Most, and you deserve to have them, but you had other wonderful things too. Yes. And I know you're right, but... Please just leave me alone for a bit. Yes, ma'am. Uh, animal, calm. Don't do the falling. <laughs> Baby, kitten. Gentle, rest, peaceful. Console, smiling. Relief. Uh, love and uh, bliss. All positive vibes. All these cherished memories I do have. And I'm here sobbing over not going to Cape Town or Rio. You're probably used to your guests falling apart, hmm? Um, it's a natural response. Yes, that's true. Being in here feels magical, though. Like you're putting my very soul at ease. It's my job. Oh? I thought your job was just to deliver me to where we're going. That's also my job. <laughs> They got you working two jobs, even in the afterlife. You all should unionize. Unionize. You're very considerate. And look where that got me. Did the cat at least live? Did I save it? No. Don't tell me, you know. I don't regret a single thing. Would have loved a vacation. Would have loved a spouse into a dub, but... I lived and died a hero. I'm okay with that. You are a hero. Oh, you continue to impress me. Oh, please. I bet you've met all sorts of cool people. A guy died just last week fighting a bear and saving a family of campers. I meant with your ability to accept things after remembering the details. Oh. Well, I am pretty cool. Now stop flirting with me or I'll get the wrong idea. Oh, I wasn't... <laughs> I'm just kidding. Or am I? Okay, I'll think I'll rest until we get there. I think of all my happy memories and not the what-ifs, you know. Thank you for everything. Of course. Honored. Right, we got more more things. Uh, Valentine. New dress. Gifty. First, I don't know. Savior. Mom's lasagna. Very good. Rest. Console. Reunion, first kiss, first laugh, baby shower, relief, 
There we go. All positive vibes. We must be here. Uh, that's right. Are you ready? I am. Don't forget what I said about the masks. <laughs> really? I'm just kidding. But you never know. Maybe the air can't kill. Again. Or whatever. But maybe it makes you sleepy or irritates your eyes. Yes, ma'am. We are here and the carriage is stopped. <laughs> Say, will, will I ever see you again, guide? It's okay. Well, go on and keep being your kind self to others, okay? Thank you. This is really touching. You never know what others are going through. We did just die after all. Goodbye. Even though still in life, you, you don't know what others are going through. Always be kind. Always be kind. This is really touching. May 1st, 11.55pm local time. Close to midnight. Still my birthday. Uh, 56. Sol is not appearing. Message to Doreen from Lycoris. Discard message. What? Wait for me. Oh, you were too late? Oh, there you are. Good evening. Hello? What a strange voice. You sound just like... How are you? Me? I am feeling... Delightful. That's good. Uh, something on your mind? It seems you will be personally delivering me to my grave. So that begs the question... Who are you? Who is your boss? Are you even one of the reapers or just a spider? Plush cushions, extravagant wear, comfortable lull of old-fashioned wheels. You can even feel mist in here, a swinging lantern. You must be here to ease my worries. But I don't have any little spider, so let's see. What will you do now? What? I have to choose one? I'm sorry, what? What? This is all... These are all negative. These are all negative. Try again. Hello? Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Something in your mind? Seems you will personally yeah, the best question. Who are you? This this has what 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 do I choose then? Do I wait until there's a positive thing? Delicacies. No. Delightful. Oh? Maybe you are a reaper after all, since that was so easy for you. Did someone send you? Do I count? What if I sent myself? You know, I have a feeling you're not actually experienced at all. Just a hunch. Now, how long ago did I die exactly? I don't discuss that. How about you? Uh, we should focus on you. Oh, well, I did have a theory that you simply don't know. That's convenient for them if you believe you've never been human. You will not question the legitimacy of your job that way. You'll last longer if you feel distant from the souls you bring to your master. Stop. Drop me off. Uh, you know I can't do that. Can't? Or won't? Drop me off. 
Now tell me, what does a job like this serve? None of this is real. It's a psychological allusion to East Souls. And I cannot be soothed unless I get back what belongs to me. Uh, which is what? Fight for it. If you won't give me what I want, then I won't give you what you want. Uh, I understand the illusion now. It's not a so let's see what happens. When you can't control me. The hell? What is this about? Banana. No, not banana. Determination. Confusion. I am confused. Oh, smart. <sighs> what do I choose? Superior. Noodles. <laughs> I like noodles. Manager. Top dog. Admin. So I need to be the 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 the, the top thing. Control. Oh, I wanted to click control. Have you been here before? No, but it could be lying. What if I have? What do you mean? Just a hunch? No, did I die? I don't discuss that. I've never lived before. Is that what I told you? It's convenient for them. Yeah, I love that place to say. Stop. Drop me off. Uh, no. Drop me off. Uh, I'm doing this for your own good. As you've been told, someone is lying to you. If you want to give me what I want, I want to give you what you want. Instead of the illusion, it's not illusion. Yeah, there we go. Bam! It is an illusion. But you can't control me. Dominate. Alpha. Uh, smart. Superior. Grip. Top dog. Manager. Admin. Reigns. Capital. Control. Eminence. Tss. Do you see that I'm helping you now? Hey, driver. Stop, sit down. Do you remember a snowy car ride middle of May? It's impossible. Impossible? More impossible than a carriage with horses you can't touch? More impossible than a carriage that changes appearance by simply imagining it? Please enlighten me. How does this carriage look to you? You're not getting out. You never liked the cold, did you? So perhaps for you, you remember it misty and blue, pretty, like the ocean. You always wanted an ocean wedding. Stop. And maybe instead of the ugly street lamps, you remember a pretty glowing lantern. Stop. Or what? You get us in a crash? Again? Yell at me again for bringing our puppy? I had to watch you both die. You knew I didn't even want to be there, and even in your last words, you wouldn't apologize. Our dog, my dog, was innocent. You monster. I don't know what the hell you're talking about. I can still forgive you. Let me out so I can help you. I can free you. All three of us. No. I wasn't asking. Dominate. Uh, recover? Jeez, this, this is all... Do you want to scream? Is that the thing? Manager? Ruler? Success? Control? Eminence was one? Uh, anarchy? No, anarchy not. Captain? Lordship? Leader? I'm just gonna go with all the... Hierarch? Triumph? Probably. Director? Mastery? Hero? Yeah, we got him. I feel it. We must be here. 
Aren't you going to tell me to get out? If you're ready. I've been ready for a while now. Ever since you took away what was mine. I bet you realize it now, don't you? You have the wrong person. What? Haha, <laughs> not that. Then what? But something is wrong. <laughs> You've always been gullible. See you soon. Well, yeah, something is wrong. Well, what the heck is going on? No idea. What was that about? Private message to Noreen from Lycoris. Questions about my carriage. There is sustaining corruption from a soul drop-off. And asking for detail on my beginning, sent. What the heck is going on? May 2nd, 118 AM, local private message to Lycoris from Noreen. Forget. Oh. Yeah, something is off. Something is not right. It's time to make another delivery. Wow, that was something is not really going well there. <laughs> oh my god. The game was really touching at first, but now the, the third soul, that was really freaking me out. Like, we were human. We That was probably our partner. Um, in my case, that was probably my wife and we had a dog. We had, a, we, we had an accident. The dog and I died. She lived. Now she died and I should carry her soul back to the thing. And she was like, hey, I can save you. So maybe we did a bad ending. I have no idea if there's good or bad endings in this game. But this was something. That's for sure. But now it's done. Like Chorus Last Words. If you want to play through the game yourself, I'll make sure to drop a link down in the description so you can check it out there. Um, everything else. Don't forget to subscribe, follow, leave a like, a comment. Most importantly, tell your parents about me. And I personally cannot wait to see you again next time. Bye-bye.